eyes and to, to speak with you and to share with you all that's happened. Now, I have so much to tell and I have so much to share, but first of all, I've got to apologize. I haven't been keeping up with you guys in video. Uh, the reason for that being is because we've just been actually so busy with, with business. To actually get sit, sitting down um, has been very, very, very difficult. Um, just because we've been so busy and we've been traveling. Uh, we've done a few things around Scotland, locally in South Asia, which has been really, really cool with various churches. And uh, that, that includes, again, singing and leading worship, which is just wonderful, wonderful fun for a church in Irvine. And we've done that uh, once or twice a month, which has been really good. So I'm gonna dump this and, uh, and I wanna share with you guys now some of the stuff that's been going on. I've actually made myself a list because I don't wanna forget anything. The first thing, the really big news, okay, we are literally now 45 days away from Art From The Heart going international. And by that I mean I am leaving Scotland for a little while, just, just for a month initially, and going over to the United States. We're gonna be in Nebraska, in Colorado, and in Maryland. Um, I mean, that is really, really cool. We're hoping as well to get a ton of photos and video footage so you guys can tune in and you can share in that enjoyment as well. Um, in Maryland, um, I'm going to be there for three weeks and Anna Reynolds is, uh, is it primary and so is Cindy, so is Cindy Freeland, I'll try that again. Cindy Freeland um, is primarily responsible for me coming over and everything else but there's been a ton of people that have helped and you know who you are and I do thank you very, very much for that and this opportunity to come over and take out from the Heart International. Um, so we're gonna be there. Now, the dates aren't exactly set in stone yet, so I'm not gonna release any information until the 100% confirmed, but over the three weeks that I'm in Maryland, approximately, um, there's a ton of different things, a ton of different activities, speaking dates, uh, charity events, promotion events uh, that, that I'm gonna be part of, and I encourage you, please, 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 come along, come and see me, come and meet with me. You know, th this God willing will not be the only chance you get, but you know, it'd be really, really cool to have a big turnout for you guys and, and to do something really special. And we'll do some songs, we'll do some painting, you know, I, and you know, I'll get to share as well uh, the story of Art From The Heart as well, which would be really, really cool. So, the second thing is, I'm gonna be in Nebraska and I'm gonna be in Colorado. And the, this is, for me personally, one of the biggest and coolest things uh, this is where the, the journey and the tour starts, is in Colorado. Um, I'm not going to give uh, particular dates away because I'm going there for vacation. Well, many things else. I'm going there for vacation if you're in America, or holiday if you're in the UK. Um, so I'm going out there and we're going to do a ton of filming. As I say, we're going to um, be taking plenty of photos, maybe even a spot of fishing and whitewater rafting. And there's going to be a lot of really, really cool stuff which I get to share with you guys and you get to enjoy as well. Um, and I know for some of you, you'd be like, oh, wow, it really sucks, you know, he's going there, but I'm not, but I want to share with you, you know, some of the stuff that, that's going on. So, and then that's really important for me to be able to do. The second thing, sorry, probably the third thing, in fact, paintings, okay. I want to share with you guys some of the, the newer stuff that we've been putting together. And I've got a couple of them here. And the first one is this one, is uh, the, the Red Blossom 2. Now, red, the red blossom tree is actually going to my friend Dixie in Texas, um, but there'd been so much, uh, I guess, love for that particular painting all over the world that I want to make different variations of the painting available, and, um, and this one in particular, I will stick this up on the, the, at the end in the credits so you guys can get a better look at that painting as well. But just so you know, these are available, you know, and it's more important for me to, to have these in your home I make it a price that's affordable to you um, than for me just to sit here with them and you know make them look nice on camera. Um, so that, that's the first one. And then we've got a couple of others as well and I'm just going to show you these briefly. Uh, My Alaskan Dream which I've revamped and retouched and, uh, and checked out and uh, yeah a whole lot of other stuff. And then yeah we, we now do, we now as well do framed paintings which is this one Sweet Surrender and I know you guys have seen that one and you've probably checked it out as well. Um, but now you can actually see it because it, it looks really good in the flesh. You can't tell a lot from a photo, but in the flesh you can see for yourselves. And it does, it looks good. You know, it's all beautifully framed with beech wood. And um, yeah, get in touch because these are, you know, very, very special, you know. 
And I'm not doing the whole pouty eyes thing, I'm just like buying my paintings. No, 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 no. The reason uh, as well, I know I'm darting around here, I do this every now and then when I get excited. We're about to go into the craft market and God willing in August, that's going to be another area that, that we really start developing. So we're looking at cards, the, the backing papers and all sorts of other things as well. And my very, very good friend Gio Imri is taking care of that side of the business. Uh, and I do, I appreciate that very, very much. And um, hopefully that's going to be something that we look at and we think, okay, this is an area that we want to go into. The fourth thing, and this, this is w one of the reasons I sent you guys uh, the link to this video in particular, artists, you know who I mean, is because all over the world right now, internationally, Europe and, and, every, and Asia and everywhere else, I'm hearing the same thing. We're all struggling artists and uh, we're all you know, really struggling just to make a living. For a lot of us, that is true. I'm not gonna say for me it isn't because for me it is as well at times, but with social media, with the use of Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, um, and, and a variety of other things as well, I want to be able to teach you guys how to make money from selling your artwork online. Now, I can't guarantee that if you put a painting in a certain area, it's gonna sell. I, can't, I, I don't make that promise but I can give you the tools and the tips that I used that from November through to January, it actually took me out of debt. And we're talking about 2,000 pounds worth of debt um, that I'd spent you know, from, from college, from uni, and uh, from my gap year as well. Um, and, and things just do the, the increase and the, the, the prices rise and everything else. So I wanna be able to teach you guys, but, and as I said, I'm not gonna lie, I'm, I'm gonna sell you the information, okay? I want to do, like we're doing now, these videos and these presentations um, so you guys can actually see this. I will, I'm, I'm very happy to sit down with you guys one-on-one -on, -one on Skype or even as a group on Skype and you can question me. You can say, well, John, what about if I do this? What about if I do that? Well, this is what I've done and this is how it works for me. I can't guarantee you'll have the same results. Okay, I want to make that very, very clear. But because I've invested so much time, money, and, and a whole lot of other things into this, and it cost me a lot to learn it as well. I'm prepared to make this available to you guys for a hundred pounds for, for the entire course, and it'll be over a two day course, and I'm prepared to keep rerunning it and everything. Um, Kiwi's actually just biting the strings on my guitar if you keep hearing a noise uh, that, that sounds like wires rattling, that's why. But, but back to the course. I'm prepared to, uh, to, to do this as I say for hundred pounds. It'll be over two days, we can run it as many times as you want. Um, the reason being for the charge is because it is, you know, my time is very, very limited with youth ministry, with, with Art From The Heart, of course, with the different uh, books that I'm working on, which I'll get to in a second, and, and all the other the things as well. Um, I do want to make this available to you. and I do want to teach you guys how to do this um, because it, it does, it works. That, that's, you know, that's what I can say about it. So, if you want to take that step with me, and you want to say, right, okay, I'm willing to invest a hundred pounds to, um, to, to actually get this course, sit down with John, do these classes and things, I'm more than available. What you will get for that, as I say, is the two-day course, and it'll be, well, it'll be split over two days. Now, I don't know how, in terms of time, we may be looking two or three hours um, to do that, but in that time, you will learn the tools, and the tricks uh, to, to actually be able to put this into practice. Yeah, Kiwi's just nibbling down here. That, that's what he's doing. Uh, you saw his little head there. Um, but so, so that's what I'm making available to you guys. Now, if you want that course, you can email me. Uh, you can get in touch at johnmorrisartfromtheheart.com or johnafthmorris at hotmail.com or on our website at johnmorrisartfromtheheart.com. Um, yeah, <laughs> so many dot coms, I'm, I'm forgetting what I'm saying. Um, so that's another area that I'm, we're starting to build up now and I would love you guys to be involved with that and actually start selling your artwork because as we know I mean the galleries are struggling right now a lot of them in Scotland seem to be closing down there's a lot of places that seem to be closing down now more and more um, not doom and gloom nothing like that but we've got to change with the times and gone are the days I think where you can just put a painting in one location and expect it to sell it may happen for you, it may not, but you can have regular work. And you guys that know me and follow me regularly know that, you know, our work has been selling. You know, yes, it is, you know, Alpha Heart is a very special um, organization. It's a, it is, um, but I, I want to help you guys. 
Okay, I do I really want to help you guys. The fifth thing, and I think this is possibly the final piece of news I want to share with you guys. Um, for years, I have battled a disease called colitis, which is a basic, basically put, it's an inflammation in the large intestine. So basically, down this side of my stomach was inflamed, okay, and, and bleeding uh, quite badly. A lot of things can be brought on by that, and stress being one of them, overwork, um, you know, not taking enough time for yourself, which all three I'm guilty of. Um, and I got up the other morning and I wasn't, I wasn't well, I, I wasn't actually able to go to work uh, at the youth group because of it. Um, and, I, and I sat down that morning at 5am and I'm chatting to some of my friends in the States and I'm like, alright, you know that based in the medical profession, I'm like, we need to get this sorted out, we need to, to deal with this, because if I'm going over to the States, I don't want to be ill, you know, that there'd be nothing worse than me being over there and, and being sick and not able to do everything that, uh, that I believe God is calling me to do. So anyway, to, to cut a long story short, I started to research it and I started to take time off, I started to rest, I looked massively at my diet as well, and now we start cutting out a lot of the, the things, and I know people will be like, oh, but I really like my pork, I really like my beef, I really like this, that and the other. All I can say is, three days on salmon, I love salmon, salmon's good, salmon, couscous, um, potatoes, spinach, uh, alpine with honey water, which is absolutely gorgeous. Who knows, maybe one day I'm going to release a, a cookbook as well. John Morris, Art from the Heart, cookbook. You know, and I'll do all the illustrations myself. We'll have great fun. Um, but as I say, if you are struggling with colitis right now, um, and that's the reason I posted this video on here as well, so you guys can hear this, I, I want to help. I'm, I'm researching at the moment the effects of colitis, uh, what causes colitis, and I want your input as well. Um, so that's the other reason that I'm saying if you buy my paintings as well, this is going to the colitis group, if you buy my paintings, um, part of the money, I think it's like 30% 30, 30 um, that goes to researching colitis and to be actually able to, to get in touch with the people I need to get in touch with and say, right, this is what the situation is, boom, how can we deal with it? And basically the, the piece of advice that I was given the other day and the, the way they explained it was Colitis is like um, an allergy. If you are allergic, for example, to milk and you drink it for years and years and years and years and you, you know, you, you, you're ill, but you keep drinking, it can actually be fatal for you. It can become cancerous. It can become, you know, and I know people don't like using these words because they're scary. You know, and I, and I had a nurse that sat down and said that to so Mr. Morris, you know, you, <laughs> we basically need to keep these two things in mind. If, if it doesn't, get any better but it lasts longer than 10 years it could become cancerous and I'm thinking great thank you very much nurse just wait 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 if it doesn't become cancerous but we can't do anything about it your bowel may explode just keep that in the back of your mind it's nothing to worry about uh having a bucket hang out my backside and someone tell me that's nothing to worry about or someone tell me I may get cancer from this thing I'm like we need to deal with this <laughs> and not to put me on steroids and not to put me on the other junk that's there and what have you um so Basically, I want to help. You know, if you're struggling with colitis, I want to be able to work with you guys because I've now found something which, which we can use and which actually does work. Three days, as I said, on, on that particular diet, it's nice. It's not a nasty diet in particular. It means that you can't have all the, the luxury items that you would like all the time. But if you can get your stomach well enough, then, you know, within moderation, you can. Um, so I want to share this stuff with you, and I'd love you to get in touch with me. So, to recap, we have the prints, the paintings. Uh, yes, that's one thing I nearly forgot, actually. The prints. I would love, I would have loved to be able to show you the actual prints framed, but our printer is under maintenance just now. Um, but these are the kind of frames that they come in. Okay, now they're absolutely gorgeous. So I've just been and picked up this one this morning, and... It's, yeah, I mean, this is 10 by 8. It's by Corley and Gill of, of England, which is a very, uh, as far as I know, a very good frame makers. Um, and they last, and they come in brown and sort of a, a light, a, a lighter brown. This one's uh, more of a lighter brown than this one, but you can tell for yourselves. Um, and the, the sketches come in those frames as well. Um, so I think that's all just for now. I will always appreciate your prayers and your love and support. 
and Kiwi's just running over my foot. Come and say goodbye, Kiwi, before we before we finish the show. There he is. Hello. Um, he's grown. You know, for you guys, remember Kiwi when he was a little baby and a little kitten, um, and he's just like absolutely huge now. He's a monster. He loves the bubble wrap. So if you if, if any of the customers and friends of ours. Um, get bubble wrap with holes in it and teeth marks, then uh, you know it's from Kiwi and he's, he's busy playing around with songs here. But thank you very much for listening, thank you very much for tuning in and I hope that um, you'll be in touch with us. He's trying to get away. Go on then boy. Um, I hope that you'll be in touch with us and you'll keep in touch. Please, please stay tuned for all the stuff that, that's happening and all the really cool things that are going on. We have a couple more books that we're working on at the moment, uh, which if you stay tuned on Facebook, you will be able to see them all. The Little Red Tomato uh, with Latoya Williams. Um, Cindy Freeland's book on mud, which is great fun. And that should be out before June, the, the progress we're making. And Anna Reynolds' book on why did, my, uh, why did cancer turn my life upside down? Um, a sequel, I believe, if I remember correctly, to why did, I, why did my dad get cancer? And I hope I've got that right, otherwise Anna will be getting in touch with me and be like, ah, if you're promoting my book, you know, you need to say it right, I got that before. Not from Anna, from someone else. But, um, yeah, and we've, as I said, there's a whole lot of other projects in the pipeline and, uh, and things that are going on. I love you guys, I really, really do, and I thank you so much for tuning in. Take care. Until next time, God bless, my friend.